Guitar picks can be one of the most important aspects of guitar playing, and I feel like it doesn't get talked about enough. For example, this is a 0.73 millimeter pick. This is the first guitar pick I ever used when I was learning guitar, and it's pretty bendy. It has kind of this sound, different texture to it. Nowadays, and for the last little bit, I've been more drawn to the Jazz 3 style, which has little to no bend in it at all, and that's just personal preference. Over here, I have this box filled with just all different types of guitar picks. When I first started playing, went to the guitar store and just got a pack of all different sizes. You can do the same. I highly recommend doing that. And the truth is, there is no correct guitar pick size. People may argue on that, but it is whatever feels the best for you. Each of them have different sounds. Sometimes you can hear it, sometimes you can't. In this video, I hope you can hear it. I decided to use an acoustic guitar for the entirety of this video just so that you could hear it the most. I'm recording through a Blue Yeti microphone. Yes, I have an SM57, but I felt like in this case, I just wanted the most like natural and realistic sound that's easiest for you to hear without some studio tampering and all that, all that fun stuff, which people still do. And that's why you can't tell a difference a lot of the time. And this video is more targeted towards people who who are just starting to play guitar and don't really know what to do. I do remember when I was starting to play, I couldn't even, you know, figure out how to hold a pick properly, which seems so dumb, but people hold their picks differently. For me, this is, you know, obviously the best best way to do it, but people like James Hetfield will use two fingers. It's all whatever your preference is. Even if you don't use picks and you're looking to get into that, that's what this video is for. It is a sound test for just basic guitar playing and how it affects the sound, how it affects the strings. It's mainly about how the pick hits the strings and that's where the width of the pick comes into play. Here I have a bunch of different guitar picks lined up as I mentioned and I want to go through each of them and just show you what it sounds like. So I'm going to play the opening bit from Live Forever by Oasis just because it is a simple chord song as incredible as the song is and it does show you how important your pick size is and the difference that it makes. And then after that I want to jump into just individual lines and even little things like that you will hear a difference. So let's go ahead and take a look at that now.
As you can hear, there is a big difference when you get to picks that are three millimeters like this one here, and they feel completely different. I think above all else, uh, sound aside, I think it's the feel of a guitar pick that is most important to your playing. For me, I play differently depending on the pick I use. I feel like they all serve different purposes for different times. I personally prefer to use, as I said, the thicker picks for most of my stuff. I could never really play any metal songs with these thinner picks, but people like Kurt Cobain and John Frusciante still use these picks. And they're still playing rock music, and it's not, you know, heavy John Petrucci, Kirk Hammett picks, and it still works for that. So it's just what you make of your sound. I highly recommend going to a guitar store if you don't already know what your favorite is, or if you just want to experiment. It's kind of fun to just sit around with them, lay down on the table and go, I wonder what this will sound like, because they all have their benefits and their downsides, of course. But let me know what guitar pick you use in the comments down below. What is your favorite. Do you want to see more videos like this? I've been trying to make more technical type videos, although this video wasn't made for super advanced people to learn the sonics of all this. It was for beginners or just people who want to mess around with guitar picks. So thank you all for watching. I will see you guys next time. Over and out.